Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from iSocialLead.com and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, we're going to talk about how do you find the best Instagram hashtags for every post, every single time. Before we jump into it, you know what to do, right? Subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. All right, now let's jump right into this and I'm going to share with you the tool I use and also the step-by-step -step process, the best hashtags for every single piece of content that goes on your Instagram. All right, now, first of all, the tool that I use for this, it's called Tailwind, and I'm gonna have a link in the description below. You can check it out. It's a, it's a growth tool for both Instagram and Pinterest. In this video, we're gonna focus on uh, Instagram and also on the hashtag aspect, hashtags feature. But feel free to check out the link in the description below, the first link, and yes, before you ask, it is my affiliate link, but this is what I use on consistent uh, basis. All right, now, so once you sign up, oh, let's go right into this tool. So I'm gonna go into my dashboard. And obviously the first thing you would do is uh, add your Instagram account, which is very, very simple. You can click on add new account and then add your Instagram account right here. I already have my Instagram account and my Pinterest account added. So that is great. All right, now let's go to I'm gonna go click on my uh, this side right here on the three bars, and then we're gonna go to the drafts because these are the posts that I'm preparing to schedule or post on my Instagram. And here's my Instagram feed. Here's something really cool about Tailwind that I have not seen many other apps do. Um, they basically suggest you look at this. So these are the times, the best time to post on my Instagram based on my engagement or based on the my activity. That's really, really cool. All right now, so right now I have two drafts scheduled, or not scheduled, but two drafts prepared that I can schedule or add content to it, the, the caption and the hashtag. So what, step number one is gonna be you'll sign up for Tailwind if you don't already have that. Step number two is gonna be you're gonna add your Instagram account to it. Step number three is gonna be you're gonna add some posts to your draft library. So I'm gonna click on add po or create a new post, and you can upload media from your computer uh, you can actually create multiple images too. Very cool feature for Tailwind. And you can also use stock images. So I'm going to go upload something from my computer. And let's just, uh, the graph. That's one of the things I like to do. So let's click on open. And it's going to bring that into my draft right here. So now I have three drafts. So when I click on this, and you see how it's already sort of like draft, putting the draft into the, uh, the best time slot. I have these two and this is the third one. Now here is something really, really cool. So if you look right here, so these are the recently used hash, let me see if I can make this bigger for you guys. Yeah, there you go. Yep. All right, so these are the recently used hashtags uh, on my account and you see how different colors. So Best is the dark green, good is sort of like, you know, okay. Niche hashtags are great, and then the orange or the red right here, that's the high competition hashtag. All right, now, to add the hashtag, obviously you wanna make sure you add your caption first, and then you can start picking or adding some of these hashtags. For example, let's say if I wanted to add the, the social media tips, and by the way, look at this, so when I put my mouse, it tells me how many posts that hashtag has, and I'll, I can also click uh, on this, and then it will just take me to Instagram and I can see all the content for that hashtag. All right, let's go back. So let's say if I add that hashtag and now watch what happens. So I'm just gonna add three dots here. So now look at this. So I added one hashtag and even though that's not, that's a good hashtag, that's a light green, but look at this now. Now it's recommending me other relevant or suggested hashtag in dark green color, the hashtag that are the best to use, right? So for example, let's say I do a social media strategy, yet yeah, that's relevant to my account. So if I add that, and you see how there are more uh, suggestions. So social marketing, oh, that's not a good one. That's a, oh, that's a niche hashtag, so that's, that's good. Uh, and then marketing strategy, look at this. Instagram marketing, email marketing, and then another thing you'll notice is, so this is one way of adding hashtags to the post specific hashtags to your content, to your Instagram posts. Another way is, let me just actually delete all of this and show you something else. 
So another thing you can do is, let me resize this window so you can see this. So there's also this button right here, see more suggestions. So when you click on that, now look at this, you're able to see more suggestions. For example, business tip, that's a very relevant and also 131,000 posts uh, on that. So I can click on that and then it gives me other suggestions too, right? I can click on this again, base tips, that's another good one. Ooh, let me go back. There you go, so I can add that. So there are multiple ways of adding hashtags to, to your caption or to your Instagram post. One other method that you can add or find hashtags for your content is you can just add uh, some of the hashtags for right in the caption box and it will start recommending you more and more. So for example, I know most of my content is about social media strategy. So I can input that in here. So I misspelled it. Let me go back and fix it. Let's see. So look at that. So it's 421,000 posts. If I select that and you see how all these suggestions change. So as soon as you start inputting some of your hashtags, all of these suggestions are updated, right? So now I can marketing strategy, perfect for me. Email marketing and some of the other ones, social media tips, that's great for me. Inbound marketing is great for me. So you see how it's finding really, really relevant and related hashtags to your content, to what you input right here. So again, you know, just to recap, the two sort of like method. One was we worked off of the suggested hashtag box from Tailwind. And the second method was we input or we put some, a couple of hashtags and then we let Tailwind do its magic and suggest us uh, some of the other relevant hashtags. Really, really interesting. Here's the other thing you can do. If you click on the saved hashtag, so let me actually erase all of this. So this tool truly allows you to find the best hashtags for your content every single time. Here's the other thing. Let's say you have done your research once and you can, you're able to save. So when I click on save hashtags, so look at this. So I've already made a list. So when I click here, so here are some of the hashtags, the research that I did uh, in the past uh, that I have right here. So once you make a list of hashtags, uh, you're able to click on the save and then you can able to, let's say, you know, list one, and you can add all of your hashtag right here and save that hashtag list for your future use. Very, very powerful and uh, time-saving feature from Tailwind. And the other kind of cool thing right here is, let me add some marketing tips, leads, marketing strategy. I'm just gonna add some, some things here, right here. All good. The other thing you can do is, if you notice right here, post hashtags in the first comment. And guess what? A lot of people, including myself, I don't like to, especially when I'm using like 25 or 30 hashtags, I don't like to put that in the in the caption itself because it can look, you know, crowded, spammy, or, you know, I prefer to put hashtag. I don't think it makes any difference, but I prefer to put hashtags in the first comment. So that's another feature that you have right here. So there you go, guys. If you want to find the best hashtags for your Instagram content every single time for every single post, Tailwind is the tool that you want to use. The link is in the description below. Yes, it's my affiliate link, but go check it out. And there are multiple ways you can start inputting some hashtag in the caption and then uh, uh, let Tailwind suggest you some. Or when you first come here, Tailwind it will automatically detect your recently used hashtag. So you can work off of those as well. And then once you have a list, you're able to save your list for future use. So there's so many ways this tool can help you find the best hashtag and also save time, right? All right, guys, if you have any questions, you know what to do. Leave those questions below in the comments. Before you go, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.